I'll do some burping while I wait. Oh, come on! Complete fucking faggotry right there. You can use my footage for anything you want, as long as it's not just blatantly, you know, copying and reposting my footage. That's all I really care about. In fact, what I actually would, would like is if someone could do like a montage of the hilarious amount of deaths that I had. I think that would be probably one of the funniest things ever. Hello everyone! DSP here and welcome to my very first new game playthrough for 2016. That's right, this game... Resident Evil Zero Remake. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, meow, meow. Oh yeah, oh, oh, oh. We gotta shoot that shit. Let's go speak at the puzzle shit. Oh! What the fuck, who's that? Who the fuck was that dude? He had like a weird popped collar. That was uh, odd. It wasn't too loud, was it? <laughs> Alright, so Resident Evil Zero. I believe this is supposed to take place before the events in Resident Evil 1. I think this just explains how Rebecca got to the mansion. I could be completely wrong. In fact, I might be, but I think that's what this is. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Last year when I played Resident Evil Remake, I got I took a bunch of shit from people because I picked normal difficulty. Everyone then jumped on my ass and said, Oh, you picked normal! Don't you know that in Resident Evil, normal is easy! Easy is super easy! Hard is normal! And then super hard challenging mode is normal hard! What? Like, when I look at this, I say, The game's telling me there's three difficult settings. Easy, normal, and hard. So if I play normal, that should be fucking normal. But now people are already... I've, I've gotten like 10 people tweeting me, You gotta play on hard, because hard is normal. What? How does this make sense? So now I gotta make the decision, right? If I play on normal, and we have a fun playthrough, Oh, I didn't actually beat the game because I beat it on easy. If I pick hard, and I, I'm dying a million times, and the, then the playthrough's boring because Phil keeps dying, Well, it's because I picked hard... Which isn't normal, or is it normal? What is normal? <laughs> Fuck yeah, I'm picking easy. Alright, no we're not. <laughs> Fine, I'll pick hard. Fuck you. You all like it hard? I'll give it to you hard. How about that? You want hard? I'll give you hard. Hard-ons for fucking difficulty. Jesus Christ. A Midwestern town a in America. Midwestern town hey. in America. Raccoon City. Shut up, Wesker. A I was reading that. Island. Boom. Boom. Before the mansion incident. So this is before the mansion. That's why it's Resident Evil Zero. Okay. No shit. A nice low-res cutscene. Hmm. Do you think so too? Yeah. About it. Yeah, I do think Jada Pinkett Smith's obnoxious and she should keep her mouth shut on Twitter about the fucking Oscars. <laughs> Uh-oh. I think it is too loud. I'm gonna lower the volume a little bit. What the hell's that noise? You heard that, right? I'm lowering the volume a little bit. There we go. What the hell? Look at this guy. Ho ho ho! He's seeing opera on a fucking roof. Oh, what the shit? Ooh. Oh, uh, I didn't know this was the fucking monster mystery train. Oh, <laughs> damn. Woo ah, yes. How did you like my leech bukkake on your train? 
Okay. The door to safety is shut. There is no turning back. Well, great. Well, I can immediately tell you the controls are pretty good. So you walk around with left thumbstick and there's no tank controls. You can actually freely run in circles. That's good. Controls. What the fuck is this? Oh my God. I'm just gonna leave it on default. I don't even wanna mess with it. Let's see what the typewriter looks like. Oh, it's very nice. Nice, nice antique typewriter. What the hell? It didn't make the classic typewriter noise. Oh, there it is. I was gonna say, come on, man. You're telling me there's no typewriter noise? There's gotta be typewriter noise. It's classic. Actually, I'm, I'm kind of wondering. I'm trying to see what the other buttons are so that the touchpad does nothing. This just pauses the game. That's good that there's an actual legit pause in the game for once. They actually didn't have that in the other Resident Evil. You have to open the menu. I don't know how you change outfits because I got some pre-order outfits, but I don't know how to do it. All right, here we go. Let's see here. What's this? Red light. Been fantasizing about me, have you? Dogs and dogs, out. apparently. That's a fucking dog. God damn it, already? Already we got no fuck. I have, like, low health now. And I can't fucking shoot the dog. I can't shoot it. Look. Wow. Nice modernized controls. The auto-aim doesn't work. She just aims for the floor and doesn't actually hit the fucking dog. Yeah, modern controls my ass. I think the old tank controls were better. What the fuck? Alright, let's take a look at this. Dining car. It's the dining car key. So we gotta go all the way back to the dining car. Oh my god. I've got you in my sights. What the fuck? She's not hit dude, I told you. She's not aiming for the enemies. The auto aim sucks. She fucking just fires wildly and doesn't actually hit the enemies standing in front of you. Great fucking auto aim. Well, here we are. The dining car. This is Rebecca. Over. I need dollar, dollar, dollar. That's what I need. Hey, hey. Alrighty then. How dramatic. So the dining car is over here. Oh, fuck you. Ooh. Notice the supervisors. When closing the dining car, supervisors are asked to switch off the automatic doors after ensuring all staff have vacated the car. The main automatic door power switch is located on the roof of the fifth car. Inspections take place when the, the train is garaged. After inspections are complete, use the ladder at the rear of the second floor of the dining car. Umbrella Corporation Maintenance Department. So apparently this train is owned by Umbrella Corporation. Oh boy. <clears throat> Uh-oh. What the hell? Oh, okay. Heads up. Ew. What the fuck? Oh, why don't you taste my wild beast then? Um, 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 um. Oh. I guess that was supposed to happen. Whoa! What the fuck is this shit? It's so weird. <laughs> Are you okay? Fuck you, Machinima. What the hell is this? <laughs> Wouldn't it be incredibly hard to stand on top of the train? I'm just saying. The train is moving. She's about to die. She's in danger. Great. Aha! The door is open now. What the hell? I'm what the fuck? Oh! <laughs> yep. No? There's something stuck in the keyhole. Prevents the door not from turning. You could probably... Get it out if you had something sharp. Ah, so now Billy is going to have to find something sharp and give it to her. I see. Here we go. All right, Billy. Go back. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Service list is stopped. Let's call the service list. He's got that knife. Maybe I gotta put the knife in here and she could use that to open the door.
The item is too large. That's not it then. We gotta find something else to give her. Darn. I thought it was the knife. Yeah, because as you can see, it's obviously such a small spot. There's no way a knife can fucking fit in there. Yeah, right. You know what? I'm gonna give him the ink ribbons too, because I want him to save. There we go. One down. Let's see if I can give him an ink ribbon. All right, we gotta go all the way back to the conductor's cabin now. Which means we gotta get past some zombies in these next few cars. All right. Zombie! These zombies are identical. Look, they're the same fucking zombie. God damn it, I wasted a bullet. The same exact zombie. The game couldn't spawn two different zombies? No, it's the same zombie. Now it's dead. Bled out. Two identical fucking zombies. Oh, fuck! I thought I was gonna get by him, but I didn't. Fuck a shithead. If I remember correctly, there's more in the next car, too. Fuck. Let's a save. Yes. Oh, Billy. What is this? What the hell is this? Oh. What is this? Join the party. People are having a wild party. Where the hell am I? Uh oh. Oh no. Fuck this. Oh, fuck me. I have nothing to fight these things with. This is bullshit. This is fucking bullshit. Fucking shit, run! <laughs> you cannot carry this item now! Ah! I knew this shit was gonna happen! I knew it! Look at this. I can't pick up anything! This sucks shit! Ammo everywhere! Items! There's a fucking shotgun! Are you kidding me? There's 500 items I can't pick up! God damn it! I'm gonna have to backtrack to Rebecca and give her the herbs. So I have at least a shotgun, everything possible. Look at this! A shotgun ammo, a fucking first aid spray. I can't pick up a goddamn thing. The, uh, the pick. There's a fucking pick I gotta give Rebecca. Can't fucking pick that up. No inventory fucking space. Fucking shit! Use combine exam or leave. Wait a minute, leave. Hold on. Let me try something. Let me try something. Oh shit! Are you kidding me? This is completely different from previous Resident Evils. You can drop items on the floor. I didn't want that. I picked up the wrong thing. And then we'll be together at least, and then we could do more inventory management. All right. Inventory management. So now I gotta completely backtrack all the way back to Rebecca. Oh, no. Oh, shit. You gotta be joking. What the fuck is that? Are you for fucking real? Oh, my God. It's not good. It's not good at all.
That was close. Almost out of ammo. Still fucking not dead, are you kidding me? Get the fuck over here! Okay. How many shots does it take to kill this fucking thing? I was shooting the tail the whole time. Are you kidding me? I wasted all my ammo. Oh my god. Uh, I have no ammo. I can't fight it anymore. Great. Because I was supposed to know you can't shoot the scorpion's tail or the bullets deflect off of it. Great. So now I have no ammo and I have to kill it with the knife. Fine, so fucking be it. Not the ice pick, the knife. I might as well take it. Fine. I'll have it your fucking way, you stupid fucking scorpion bitch. Over here, bitch! Ow! Fucking dick! Come over here! No! I got it! Killed it with a fucking knife. Guns are too quick. I got a trophy for killing it with a knife. Shithead scorpion. What is this? What the fuck? What is it? A hook. God damn it. I can't carry everything. Killed him with a fucking knife. Oh, I need to get the ice pick for sure. Yeah, I have to get the ice pick, so I have to drop something here. I might as well leave all these weapons. I got no ammo for them. Right? Oh, I can run right by him. Run. He's distracted right there. Okay. <clears throat> Let me guess. It's going to lead back to the other area he just came from. Yup, I knew it. Oh my god! Why are there flaming fucking zombies? Just came from here. There was no fucking flaming zombies. Okay. Getting back up or you dead? Here he comes. Alright, now he's fucking dead. Because he couldn't use his hand. He couldn't use his fucking hand to open that. He had to use the tool. Are you kidding me? That is some fucking stupid shit right there. Items here. 
Ink ribbon. It's not. I wanted to grab the ink ribbon. She opened the door. Oh my goodness. Doop -a -doop -a -doo. All right, save room. Good. So now we've got a lot of progress, right? And we've got a, a logical starting point from the save point. So that's good. All right, well, that's all that was in here. So we got to backtrack all the way now back to the access panel, which means we got to get by those zombies one more time. <sighs> one more time. And of course, keep in mind we're going to have to come back later when we get the key card to open up that other fucking door. Backtracking, backtracking. I'm going to see if I can book it through this room. Fucking shit, I can't. First well, floor. That was fast. <laughs> it wasn't even me who died. Stupid AI died. It just fucking stood there and took it. Come on. Character switching. You switch control between two new characters, Red and Billy, and use different abilities to progress the game. The character you currently control is called the main character, and the character you not control is the partner. The partner character generally moves independently, but you can use right thumb to control them yourself. Selecting partner on the status screen allows you to assign structures of character. Both characters move independently solo. Team partner calls the main character. Attack partner attacks automatically. Idle partner will not attack. You can also press the touch pad to switch between solo and team behavior. Both the main and partner character will die if they take too much damage. You should always keep an eye on their condition. The partner can attack in a different room will call for help with the radio. If your partner does call for What the hell's this? Well, I guess we gotta kill these fucking zombies. Resident Evil Zero. God damn, Billy! Billy! Oh, Billy! Your first death, Billy! Oh, Billy! <laughs> Billy, you were a... What the? Billy, you were a fucking zombie buffet. Oh, Billy! I didn't die. Billy died. I did not die. Billy died. Blame the AI. Don't blame me. Billy's a fucking noob. So we're gonna have to waste ammo on these stupid fucking zombies again. Doesn't count. I don't count that as a death. I didn't die. Nice auto aim where she fucking fires wildly in the wrong direction. <laughs> Ew! The fuck was that sound effect? That was gross. We gotta count separately. Times when I die and times when the computer dies because it's fucking stupid. So far we got one really stupid computer death. Oh man! Fucking Terminator zombies! Fine, I'll be hard. Stay dead. They're terminators. Well, you want some too. It's identical to the other one. Why do they keep putting identical zombies in the same cars? They can't do oh my god. They couldn't bother to animate different zombies. You pay $20 for this remake. Fight the same zombie 47 times. Fuck you. Alright, we made it. Fucking shit. Uh, it's fucking close as hell, dude. Good God. I'm gonna care. I don't care about the odor. A gold ring. Are you kidding? That's what I gotta put on the briefcase, I bet. We got one of two. I gotta find another gold ring with a fucking gold cock ring. <laughs> The conductor wore, was kinky. He always wore fucking metallic co platinum and gold cock rings he wore. You have to take two of them off the cocks of the zombies and dogs, and you can open the briefcase. What the fuck kind of a key is that? A fucking metal ring? A metal cock ring. What can he put down? Oh, fuck it. There. I still don't have enough space. Fucking shit. What is this? Dude, it's way too loud to... It's way too loud to fucking read this. Hold on a second. Hold on. It's way too, too fucking loud. Alright. Now we can fucking hear ourselves. Let me read this. Hookshot Operator's Manual. Welcome to Zelda. Alright, back to the audio here. Okay, we can try to kill this fucking guy ninja style. Ready? Ninja style. Ready? Ah! 
Are you kidding me? I was fucking stabbing your fucking ass. Oh my god. He won't die! Fuck you! Of course now she's hurt. Of course she is. Danger! God, fuck. I knew it. The other cock ring. The platinum cock ring. She got it. Oh, it's silver. The silver cock ring. By all cock rings combined, I am... A blue key card! <laughs> By all cock rings combined, I am Captain Key Card! <laughs> okay. Exciting. Out of the way. Come on, Billy. Alright, we got one more left after this. La 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 la. Fucking run. Fuck this. Fuck that shit. I'm not fighting them. Fuck that. Nope. Fuck him. Skillful, artful dodge right there. You gotta be joking me. This is a joke! This is a cruel joke! This is a cruel fucking joke. My god. What a mess. Use to operate the brake. What do I do? Huh? Oh my god, I'm supposed to get 81. 82! Damn. 8888888879. No! Damn it! 7. There we go. Fuck. She's gotta do it too? Oh my god, 67. 18, 27. 36. 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 67. She's just a rookie, a member of STARS. Hmm, what about the male? I'm unfamiliar with him. Attention. Mm -hmm. He's a gay this porn star. Please be silent as we reflect upon our company motto. Obedience breeds discipline. Discipline breeds unity. Unity breeds power. Power is life. <laughs> who are you? This guy. It was I who scattered the T-virus in the mansion. Needless to say, I contaminated the train too. My name what? is Siegfried. My we friend Roy will be by soon. On Umbrella. Who is this guy? Is he singing? He is. Great. What a great plot. Dr. Marcus? <laughs> Wait a minute. Save successful. Alright, cool. So we're done with the train. We're in a new mansion. Awesome. There we go. Oh, man. Oh, baby. Now we're talking. <laughs> what the hell? This is excellent. Oh, what's that? There's a piece of paper on the ground. Oh, this is nice. She has no boobs, though. She has, like, literally nothing. Look, yo. She's got nice boobs. All right, anyway. Case 1-1. One, one. <laughs> you like my observations? They're just so mature. Uh, all right. The facility key. I want to take a look at the emblem on the key. Wait a minute. Oh my god! No! Oh, I'm glad I saved. How the fuck do I kill this thing? Fuck. Wait a minute! She has the shotgun shells? Oh no. I'm boned. Well, that's it. I'm gonna have to knife the fucking thing. I don't know what to do. I'm done.
By the way, I have no healing items for him either. Well, guess we're doing this one over again. Great. You know, if I had known this was going to happen, I probably would have given him the shotgun shells. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Resident Evil. Good thing I fucking saved. <laughs> Now I know to give him all of the da all of the ammo. He needs all of the fucking ammo. Damn. Oh, <sighs> well, we'll try it again. All right. So, take two for the centipede. I'm gonna make sure he has all the fucking ammo. I'll give him all the guns and everything. Hopefully now we can kill the fucking thing. <clears throat> I only have three bullets left. What the fuck? Final victory. That's it. I'm done. Dude, I used every piece of ammo. What the fuck is this? So obviously... Obviously there's something I'm supposed to do to kill this, and I don't know what it is. Uh... I seriously shot the fuck out of it. I shot the fuck out of its underbelly and its face, and I still couldn't kill it. I used every piece of ammo I had. What do they want me to do? I don't understand what the game wants me to do. Uh... I'm gonna have to look this up. What else am I supposed to do? Obviously, there's something, a pattern or something I'm supposed to know, and I don't know what it is. This is very silly. Yeah, I don't know that. I don't know what to do, man. Maybe I can't do this yet. Maybe I gotta come back here when I have more ammo. That's what I'm thinking. At this point, I don't think I could do it. I need more ammo or something better to fight fight with this fucking thing. I just put all of my rounds into it and it didn't die. Well, there's other areas to check out we didn't even go to yet. By the way, there's a giant weapon right there, look. Well, she's dead. God damn this fucking ridiculousness. I walk in the room, there's fucking giant bugs. But you saw that, right? There's a giant weapon right there sitting on a fucking love seat or whatever that was, a, a fucking barca lounger. <laughs> whatever that thing is, a chase. On the chase, there's a giant weapon. We gotta kill these bugs and get the weapon, so I'll, I'll use the other rifle. God damn it. Now we know to leave her there. Fucking bugs. These bugs are annoying as shit. The whole game is bugs, you notice that? Slugs, bugs, and fucking leeches. Slugs and bugs and birds and leeches. It's all fucking nature's kingdom trying to kill us. <laughs> Has nothing to do with zombies. There's like four zombies in the game. It's all fucking bugs. If you don't like bugs, don't play this fucking game. The whole game's bugs. It's disgusting. Why can't I just fucking call the organ man to take care of this shit? Comes in with his fucking bug spray, kills everything. Wow. Projectile bug. This shotgun sucks! It does like no damage! This is a close range shotgun and the fucking thing's like, oh, who cares? Kill. Oh my god! Double fucking kill! Whoa! Ah, Billy! Oh, Billy! Ah. 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 Right in the face! He didn't like that, not at all. I'm gonna get this fucker now with this rocket launcher, or grenade launcher. I missed. There we go. I got three shots I hit him with, I only got two left, I missed one, fuck. Alright. Die! 
Motherfucker won't die. I have one more shot left. He didn't die. Five fucking grenades. He's not dead. God damn. Dude, that's fucking an insane amount of fucking rounds. He's not dead. I did it! I picked her up again. Wait a minute. What? It dropped her, but then it picked her up again. What do I do? Ugh. There's some tactic here. I'm supposed to grab her or something? I don't know. I don't know what to do in this boss fight. Antiquated boss fight. This sucks. It sucks. I'm not going to kill it. This sucks. Antiquated boss fight. The boss isn't a normal boss. It's a puzzle. Classic Resident Evil game. I can't kill it. I'm done. One bullet left. I did it. Are you kidding me? I killed it with the last bullet. Oh my god, I killed it with the last possible bullet. Ah, 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 ah. Wow. This sucks. Why do you only have six inventory spots? Fucking stupid game. So antiquated, man. So antiquated. Classic Resident Evil game. <laughs> Okay. Alright, look at that sound. there. This way. Okay, alright, okay. Dude, right over here. It's in here. I'll find out. Okay, boom, boom, boom. This room is dead. I can close the room. It's in here. Oh, this is the bush. And we're here. Close up. Nice. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay. Darn, I don't remember if I split the part or not. Shit. Well, this is a really short part on YouTube. I apologize. I don't remember if I split it. I'm going to split it now. Okay. Very good. Okay. All right, let's see what's in this other room. I have no inventory. Zombie, fuck that. Fuck that. I'm not fucking with no zombie. Fuck that shit. Go in this room. Good. And I'm gonna leave the knife. Fuck it. Oh, come on now! What is this? Uh. Fuck that guy. Get out of here. Why the hell didn't didn't fucking he never come with me? Billy didn't come with me. Wow. Where is Billy? Well, you're dead. Wow! He's a complete asshole. Billy is a fucking asshole. Well, I'm not going over there now. Now we know. We know on that side, the only thing the only thing that's over there that I could use right now is a healing item. I don't need it. So I'm not going to go over there. I'll go the other side of the hallway then. I'm glad I saved. Oh my god! Why are there so many zombies? 
What are we supposed to do? I don't... I'm gonna have to have Billy stay behind. Resident Evil. She's gonna have to take two guns, Zero. but we got no ammo for the other guns. So we're fucked. Because all I have is handgun ammo. <laughs> Why are there a hundred fucking zombies in this stupid fucking room? This ain't fair. Fine, I'll be Oh, yeah, of course. Because I'm shooting him directly. I just, it fucking doesn't stop him. I'm going to have to keep going in and out of this door till they're all dead. Come on! I don't know what they want me to do. I can't kill all these mo these zombies. I'm fucked. Oh, looks great. Okay, man. Oh my god! What, dude? I'm done. There's no possible way I can get past all these zombies. Not with this many bullets. This is insanity. Great. I I'm done. This sucks. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. The game doesn't give you enough ammo. And the guns that it gives you to, to kill things, they, they fucking don't give you any ammo for them. I'd use all my ammo on the boss. What? Uh, I didn't have a gun. I'm dead. What? This sucks. This is insane. What the fuck do they expect me to do? There's no ammo. I'm using a, a weak ass handgun and there's no ammo for any of the weapons that are good. So what do you want me to do? I don't know what I'm going to do here. I really don't. Have to keep doing this till they're all dead. Go in and out, shooting them. Okay, I pressed the button and he just fucks hit. Bullshit, dude. Fucking bullshit. He's right in front of me. Fire. No, I get grabbed instead. So much fun. Very well thought out. Oh my god! Two bullets to the face, he's not dead. What? How did I make it to the door? So, up next, gotta go back to that narrow hallway that Rebecca died in. Try to kill those three zombies with these fucking 13 bullets. <sighs> and if we get through there, see what's next. Damn. 
All right, well, everyone, welcome back. This is the continuation of my Resident Evil Zero remastered playthrough. This is actually my second gameplay session, so second day that I'm actually playing the game. And I just learned something. Look at this. I literally just learned this. You can control both characters at the same time by using the thumbsticks, which I didn't know. What the hell's this? You switch control between the two leagues. Characters Rebecca and Billy and use their different abilities to pro progress to the game. Warner character generally moves independently, but you can use right thumbstick to control them. So, what that means is I could basically have them both dodge zombies at the same time if I need them to. That's actually kind of cool. I like that. Um, but what I think I want to do, and this is just for the sake of completeness, alright? And the sake of, uh, kind of being on the safe side, is I think I want to backtrack a little bit. And make sure that I've gotten all the items and everything that have been important up to now. Alright, so let's take a look here. My problem is this fucking bug. I gotta kill this bug in this room. Fucking bug's in there. This bug is a pain in my fucking ass. What I'm thinking, maybe, now that I have the bottle from I found in the kitchen, bring the bottle with me into the bathroom, combine it with the gas canister to make Molotovs, and try those on the leech guy and see if they work. <clears throat> I don't think we have any items in here that I want. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding? There's a hundred zombies in here. How am I supposed to do this? Fucking shit. I have, like, no bullets. I have no fucking ammo. Look. I have, like, I have 15 bullets. I'm done. That's all I have. And no healing items. I'm so fucked. I think our next goal is gonna be go this way. Go to that bathroom. Make the Molotovs. Get the healing items. And then try to get the leech guy with a Molotov cocktail and see what happens. <clears throat> get rid of the ink ribbons. Yeah. So she can grab the two... Yeah, she can grab the two herbs combined, and then she can grab the gas, put it, and make the Molotovs. Alright, yeah, we're just gonna do it this way. Get rid of the ink ribbon. 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 Combine those. Wait a minute, I thought I gave him the ink ribbon. Are you fucking serious? I swear to God, I thought I gave it to Billy. I don't want this fucking ink ribbon. God damn it. Now I'm fucked. Because now I got too many inventory spots. <laughs> oh, no. Alright. Here he comes. Is that it? Ow. Oh my god. Ow. I'm dead. Yup. Burned alive. I killed him. I killed him with a Molotov, but now I'm all fucked up. And I gotta use the healing item. You've gotta be joking me. <laughs> this could have gone a lot better. Fuck this. I'm redoing it. I'm, that could have gone way better, dude. Because I did, first of all, I didn't want the ink ribbons anyway. Resident Evil. Doing it again. Zero. I'm fucking doing it again. The modern marvels of game saving. I'm glad I saved. Fuck. I blew that shit so bad. I had them too, and I got hit anyway. Because I didn't know it was going to take all three. It took all fucking three. I need to find more bottles now. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, if you disagree with my tactics of restarting, why don't you play the game? <laughs> yeah, why don't you buy it and play it? <laughs> How about that? <clears throat> Take that shit. Thank you, you fucking worthless humans, for the views. 
Okay, now let's burn ourselves a fucking leech man. It's pretty creepy. Look, he's in the in the fucking mirror. I like that. Well. Got him. What? He didn't die this time. What the fuck? How did he not fucking die? Fuck you. I hit him with all three, and this time he doesn't die. Resident Evil. No, you know what that is? It's Zero. called a very dated game mechanic where if I'm not done with my animation from when you hit me with a Molotov, the second Molotov doesn't count. <laughs> well, that's fucking stupid. That's really stupid. Nice and consistent. Yeah, right. Old ass fucking games doing this shit. Dumb shit. This time you better fucking die, and I better not get hit. Oh, there's another bottle right there. Oh, he didn't die. Even though I hit him with three. Great. Bullshit. Got him. Sucks he doesn't drop an item. It would have been great if he did. Well, I had to waste four bottles because even though I killed him with three last time, it doesn't work this time. Perfect, consistent ch uh, sense, right? Sounds like there's more than one zombie. How am I supposed to kill these guys with no fucking ammo? Look at this bullshit. Come on. Oh, my God. All right, I'm going back to Billy. I'm going to go give go back to Billy and give Billy the healing item and have him heal. And have him fight these fuckers. Plus, I need to get the fucking uh, slide anyway. Oh, my God. There's another leech man. This is fucking bullshit. Wow, couldn't dodge. What the fuck was I supposed to do there? Look at this, I got damaged. Oh no, I didn't get damaged. I was supposed to fucking do something. Yeah, okay. So now we gotta go upstairs, that room insanely full of zombies, and try to clear it out. Let's see what we could do here. I got 30 bullets. It should be enough to kill them all. Yeah. Another projector slide, which is what I need. Neatly filed documents, nothing of interest. There's only one guy left. So I'm pretty safe here. I can keep running around the table if I need to. Wow, I somehow dodged. I can't believe it. Uh, 
A chessboard. The game appears to have ended in a checkmate. Well, that's exciting. Oh, look at this. It's a giant chess game. See this? All right, let me look at this chess. So you have your two castles. I'm going to write this down, too. So here's your chess board. It's, uh, what, 16 by 16, right? I'm making it right now. I'm drawing it on my notepad. So we got a castle. That's your queen or king there. I'm writing it down. I'm writing this down right now. Castle. I think that's the... I can't believe that. I think it's a pawn. And then that's the king. Okay. I just wrote this down on my notepad. Thank God I had this. This one. So I can move the king. Oh, no! Well, I'm fucked. That didn't work. I was supposed to push the king. The king's supposed to go this way. Well, he's dead. What I was trying to do was push the castle out of the way so I could push the king where we were supposed to be, and it didn't work out too well. How the fuck was I supposed to know that was going to happen? God damn it. Resident. Because, you know, if you're ever going to build a giant mansion, the first thing you would do is make an insanely large chessboard that if you move the wrong piece, you get gas blasted in your fucking face. Talk about fucking complicated bullshit. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. Yeah, see, so the, here's the thing. The king has to be moved right where I'm... Oh, my God. Right here where I'm standing. But how the fuck am I going to push it over there? Because the king cannot... Right now, the king cannot move down. If the king moves down, he's in check. He'll kill himself. Yeah. How the fuck do you do this? A uh, chess... Board. The universe ended in a checkmate. It's obvious that this is supposed to be a chess a chess puzzle. Oh, well, that was way easier than I thought it was. I overthought it. I thought it was like actually the rules of chess that he get the king would get killed if I moved him to where the pawn was. I was wrong. Oh, this is bullshit. How am I supposed to get past this fucking guy? This is bullshit! I'm gonna get bit no matter what. I don't see a way to dodge this zombie. He's gonna grab me. Alright, fuck this! What the hell? I got by him! Huh? Uh... Do they actually look hurt, or does it more look like they have, like, a, a gastrointestinal discomfort right now? <laughs> it looks like they had, like, a big Chipotle burrito. And they're so fucking discomforted right now, they're like, oh, God. Giant pocket of gas processing in my, my bowels. <laughs> oh, my God. Two dickhead zombies. You heard that guy? Oh. <laughs> Oh, shit. Uh, what the fuck is this? Oh, come on. There's two fucking zombies in this room. I have no weapons. I have no weapons. How am I supposed to loot this room with no fucking weapons? Oh, my God. The zombie's right there. Dude. Fuck this. A first aid spray. Oh my god. I still have an ink ribbon. Damn it. Red plus blue equals sulfuric acid. Green plus red equals strippers. I wrote that down. Okay. No! Are you kidding me? It's a chemical, but I need a container to carry the chemical. 
I don't have a container. What are they talking about? Fuck. I'm so boned. Here's what I'm going to have to do. As much as this sucks, right? So everything I just did was completely worthless, by the way. I'm going to have to go take that, that flame rounds, put them into my fucking grenade launcher. I'm going to have to go to the downstairs corridor full of zombies and waste the grenades to get past them. And probably that's where everything is. I guarantee you all the items I need are over there. Son of a fucking dick. There's more zombies in this than ever any Resident Evil besides Resident Evil 2, but at least there you could dodge the zombies. Wasting my goddamn grenades on this shit. Here we go. Get ready. Time to waste grenades. Are you fucking joking me? Oh, grenade direct hit to a zombie didn't fucking kill it? What? A direct hit. With a grenade. Didn't kill the zombie. This is insanity, this game. Oh my god! It missed. It fucking missed. Even though it's supposed to have an auto-aim mechanic in this fucking game, it fucking missed. Fuck this game. Fuck this bullshit. It blew past his head. This sucks. You're combining crippling difficulty with archaic fucking mechanics that fuck you over. Yeah, that was really my fault. That the shotgun blasted past his fucking face. Fuck you. Stupid fucking game. Stupid fucking game sucks. God damn it. Old ass shit. Point blank shotgun to the face. No damage. Yeah. Oh my god! Fun! I'll be hard! Classic Resident Evil game! Yeah, that was really my fault. That the shotgun blasted past his fucking face! Fuck you! Stupid fucking game. I'm so glad I played this on hard. I'm so glad that I listen to people who know what they're talking about when they really don't. Thank you, you fucking worthless humans, for the views. Yeah, this is not normal fucking difficulty. This is bullshit, is what this is. Now I gotta waste these fucking grenades. Ugh, of course. The other zombie is gone. What? Wow. The other zombie has vanished from the room. Well, that's it. I'm done. I'm now officially done. I don't know what else to do. I've been... Just take a look. I've been in every single room that I could go in. And at this point, I have no clue what the game expects me to do or thinks that I haven't done. Because I've been in every room and gotten every item. Every single room and every single item. The only rooms that aren't open are the runs that are red there. Those are the ones that need the water key, I believe. So, uh, I'm stumped. Consider me stumped. I can't do anything here. Can't do anything here. And that room's full of bugs, by the way. I need all the tablets to progress. Right? Can't go to the right there to that locked door or the left. This floor, I've examined every single room. I can't get past the gas. And here, it's the base. I'm done. What are you supposed to do? There's got to be something so cryptic that there's no way you would fucking figure it out unless you just mash around like an idiot. 
There's probably, there probably is. There's probably like a, a hidden item somewhere I was supposed to get that I didn't see in one of these fucking rooms. Probably it's, you know what it is? It's probably the item, the piece of the statue or something. The piece of the white statue that I need to finish that puzzle out there. It's probably sitting around randomly in a room and I didn't get it. The door unlocked. Oh my god. Well, at least I got progress. Where does this go? Another room. I guarantee you there's an enemy in here. And I only have one grenade. I have one grenade. <laughs> Man. Alright, let's see what happens. Get ready. Oh my god! Are you fucking serious? You've got to be joking. I'm just gonna stand here. I don't think I'm gonna do anything. I'm just gonna stand here. I mean, I could probably get by them, but I don't know what else is in the room and I'm gonna get stuck. Alright, fuck this. What is this? No, there's grenade rounds! Grenade rounds! No! No! Wow, it took two grenades to kill a regular zombie. That's just exciting. And that's gonna be my last save. I have no other fucking ink ribbons. This is it. This is the last one. Oh my god. Three grenades to kill one spider, huh? Wow. I'm probably going to be redoing this. Oh, that's good. The controls reversed twice while I was running. I'm probably going to be redoing this. Oh, yeah, I got a bunch of herbs. I got a typewriter, even though I have no ink ribbons. Oh, new ink ribbons. And a map. And, oh my god, this is pretty elaborate, huh? We're going to a whole new area here. All right. gonna run by them this time zero three grenades to kill a spider in in hard difficulty boy am i glad that i listened to people who said that hard was normal no it's not no hard difficulty is not normal difficulty and i'm, t I'm not gonna listen to this bullshit anymore i'm really not from now on i'm gonna play a game of the difficulty i want to and if you don't like that don't watch because this is ridiculous this is absolutely ridiculous Normal grenades don't even kill zombies. You know what? <clears throat> Never again. Never again will I second guess myself and listen to bullshit. I will play it with the level that I'm supposed to be playing it on. Good. From now on, normal difficulty. Still got two left, so that's excellent. What the fuck? I used the green herb, it had no effect. It didn't do anything. Nice. Oh my god, it did nothing. Whoa, holy shit. Some serious uh, S&M shit going on in here. You like my observations? They're just so mature. Uh, all right. Panel looks like it controls electric voltage in the room. Adjust the panel. This should work. <clears throat> yep. <clears throat> Great. Well, she's fucked. I guess I'm gonna be going to the monitor room now. So there she is. Just gotta hurry. 
Oh, the monkey. Skip it. <laughs> Here's a monkey group anyway, you can't save. Oh, good, thanks. Thanks for the bite. Gas. Bullets. Bullets. Why? I don't have a gun. Nope. I don't have a gun. Cause I didn't know I needed one. Okay. Dead Ted Vinsky. Oh, good. Shotgun rounds. I don't have the shotgun. I don't have the shotgun. Ugh. How do I save her? I don't know how I save her. Well, redoing the whole segment. So let's see. Didn't have a shotgun, didn't have the handgun, didn't have any of the weapons I needed to do this part. Great. Resident Evil Zero. So I get to do the whole part over. How exciting. How exciting. Oh good, he gets hit again. <laughs> again, somehow my fault. I just love how it does off-camera attacks, changing the attack pattern of the enemy I dodged a million times before. My fault, though. Back to fucking caution. I'm gonna use the shotgun first. Come on, get off me. I'm gonna get so fucked. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna have to go back in and out of this door a hundred times. Watch. Fuck. Scared me. can't attack. They never let you. The monkeys are just a non-stop gangbang. Wow. Fair. And you know, because I had no health because the spiders cheaply attacked me twice with no way to dodge. Resident I died almost instantly. I love it. And I have no healing items either. This is great. This is just fucking great. What I'm going to do... Here, I know exactly what I'm going to do. I know exactly what I'm going to do now. I'm going to fucking... Save again, so I don't have to redo all this shit again. Watch, you'll see. Alright, let's do it again. So much fun. I also like how I did a point-blank shotgun blast to the, the monkey's face. The monkey was like, oh, what was that? It was delicious. Thanks. I'll take another, please. Didn't even give a shit. Oh, look at that! Off camera again! Off-camera attack, you can't dodge. You know what? You know what? I don't want to fucking do this. I'm getting pissed. I was able to easily dodge these things before. Now they off-camera attack you, and there's no dodge in the fucking game. So what the fuck do they expect me to do? Be a magic man and fucking fly through the air over them? This is fucking stupid. I'm so glad I played this on hard difficulty. I'm a genius for listening. Already jumped on me. I'm gonna die. Wow.
He didn't die. He's getting up. There's no way, dude. This is insane. This is insane. <laughs> wow! He didn't even touch me. He didn't do a, a hit animation. He missed with the jump animation, but still did damage. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I saved. This is insane. I don't think I have enough ammo to even kill all of them. I really don't. I don't think I have enough. Three multiple grenades into the the monkeys. They didn't die. Multiple grenades, and they didn't die. What the fuck? Hard difficulty. Wow, this was a smart idea. I'm so glad I listened to these geniuses. <laughs> multiple grenades don't kill a monkey. Great. <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy. I'm in trouble now. I'm certainly in trouble now. No dodge mechanic! No, dodge mechanic. No, you're fucked. Now I'm in danger. What? It did more damage than it did before. What is wrong with this fucking game? It did like double damage from what it did the last time that guy bit me. This is stupidity. What? That guy did not bite me before. Oh my god. Wow. Wow, this is What the fuck? Is this real? Oh my god. Oh, I really want to see Oh, oh, good. Well, I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep. No. Oh, he didn't die. I shot that monkey with two two gren uh, rock uh, grenades. He didn't die. You saw it, right? He was still alive. This is insane. Zero. This is absolutely insane. This is absolutely insane. I, I, don't, I don't know how I'm going to beat this. I don't. I got them. I did it. What do I do? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I didn't even need to come in here. Oh my god. You can't save her from here. You've got to be joking. What a beginner's trap. You've got to be joking. It's an ultimate beginner's trap. You don't need to kill these monkeys. Because you saw what happened, right? The gas turned off. I'm supposed to backtrack all the way to the basement and probably catch her from below. I didn't need to do this at all. Oh my god. Resident Evil Zero. Well, I fucking did it. Fuck those monkeys. I killed them. At least I have a personal sense of achievement that I killed the goddamn monkeys. 
Here we go again. Damn, those fucking monkey assholes. <laughs> I'm actually not angry anymore. Now that I know I don't have to do that, I'm actually not angry anymore. Wow, what a bunch of trollish dicks. You don't even have to fight the monkeys. Wow. That is some troll mode shit. You've got to be joking. He's the fastest zombie in the game. I can't run over there. Wow. Well, great. Oh my god, this guy fucking got up. Are you serious? <laughs> She's dead. Ah! Oh my god, this fucking game is insanely silly. Okay, let's continue. Resident Evil Zero. So I'm just gonna go out on a limb, and I'm gonna say I don't think that that's what I'm supposed to do. All right, try again. We've only been doing this for an hour now. It's fine. We'll keep going. This is what they want. <laughs> Did you kill 23 people? Of course. I'm not going to judge you. I just want to know the truth. It was around this time last year. Oh, we get backstory now. Cool. Great. What a great plot. And luckily, there's a save point, so. Alright, let's hear Billy's backstory. Some died from the heat, others were killed by the enemy. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
was no guerrilla hideout. What do you mean? The idiots in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty-handed, oh no. Our leader ordered us to attack an innocent village. Sounds like Vietnam. Get rid of them! Kill them all! Please, sir! Cease fire immediately! Shut up! Ugh. Great. Do it! What was the point of that exactly? <laughs> the idiots in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty handed, oh no. Our leader ordered us to attack an innocent village. Well, guess what? Ink ribbons. Very nice. Well, that was a, a very tough segment. Only because, again, if you knew what to do, you could easily get past that segment in five minutes. If you don't know what to do like I didn't, I blew an hour. But now I got past it, so good. Well, there was security camera in here. Ah. Uh... We stopped the gas leak? Yes! Okay, finally. Okay. Uh, I just missed with a hundred shots for no reason. I'm standing right in front of it. Well, no more shotgun shells. What did we get? All right, so he's going to head down. I'm going to have her open the doors for him. Oh, here we go. I'll go alone. Okay. Oh my god! Surprise, motherfucker! Oh fuck! I think he needs to have the grenade launcher. That's why they give him the acid rounds. Yep. Resident Evil. That's why they Zero. gave the acid rounds there, so that you can use the grenade launcher to kill these assholes. All right. God damn it. God damn it. Hunter. Who even knew hunters were in the game? There were no hunters up to now. All right. Well, no lie, everyone. I left my PS4 on resume mode. Or not resume, what was it? Standby mode? For several days. I didn't even realize that I did this. <laughs> I really didn't. I just turned my PS4 back on. It, it just resumed from where we left off. Oh, good. Spider fucking bit me. I'm gonna die now. Yep, look at this. What a bunch of bullshit. Mm. 
Now I gotta run past all the monkeys and not get hit or else I'm gonna die. Oh my god. Great. Well, that was fucking fair. Oh my god, are you fucking for real? This is insanity, these monkeys, man. I think we're gonna have to kill them. I think we have to kill the monkeys. I'm gonna have to ever stand there and bl or have one of them blast the monkeys away. I gotta save, though. I have to, because I'm probably gonna die a bunch of times here, so I have to use my last ink ribbon. Wow. Don't know what to say the monkeys won't do. Don't know what to say the monkeys won't do. Flying sli swipes, they will kill you. Overpowered monkeys, man, they suck. All right, well, amazing. I have to use it. I have to use my last ink ribbon. I have to. Hopefully, I'm going to find more soon. God damn it. This fucking blows. See if I can kill a monkey with the shotgun. I, I, it has to be Rebecca, too, because... He has no health. He can't even take a hit. I killed all the monkeys. Oh, there's ammo here. I had to waste all the fucking ammo, but I killed all the monkeys. Oh my god, it's a leech man. Motherfucking leech man. Well, I'm going to equip my Molotovs. Oh. Wow. Four fucking Molotovs to kill him. Four. And now she's in danger. Four. Oh my god. Fucking shit, dude. How am I going to get by him? I'm done. Dude, there's no way. There's no fucking way. How am I going to do this? I have no healing items and nothing. I have one Molotov. It's not going to kill him. And we have no more bottles. I have three gas, but no more bottles to combine with it. I'm completely fucked. Oh my god. This was us. Holy shit, man. You almost had my ass. <clears throat> what could possibly go wrong? Got it. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No. I blew his fucking head off. What? I blew his head off. He still grabbed me. You've got to be fucking joking. Oh my fucking god. Resident Evil. I blew his Zero. head off. He still killed me. Wow. What on earth? That is fucking insane stupidness. I ruined mine. Run. I blew his head off. He still killed me. Oh my god. I'm fucking speechless right now.
gonna let him kill me. That was complete bullshit. This is fucking stupid shit. Resident. I will never play a game on hard again. I don't care what anyone fucking tells me. This is it. What the fuck? This is pissing me off. Last time I was able to kill them. Now I can't kill them. Now they're they're tougher. <laughs> they're actually tougher. Resident Evil Zero. Playing this on hard was the dumbest fucking decision I ever made in my life. And I've done some dumb shit. This is the, probably the dumbest. Alright, you know what? I might as well just have her go. Yeah, I might as well just have her go take on the leech man now. Try to kill the one in the hallway. Because if she dies, fuck it. We're done. <laughs> Hopefully she won't because she has a little bit more health than she did last time. What the fuck? Well, I got him, but look, now she's in danger. Unbelievable. She stopped aiming. You saw that, right? This is what I hate about this game. They made it an auto-aim mechanic that doesn't work properly. So she shoots the guy twice, then stops aiming for him. So I just wasted a ton of ammo. Fucking stupid. Controls. What the fuck is this? So, I'm not going to use the healing on her. I'm going to use it on Billy. Let's go all the way back to Billy, and then we'll do some inventory management. And then we got to try to get past the fucking, uh... We gotta get past the, the leech man to get the, the device. Oh my god! Holy shit! A fucking leech man appeared out of nowhere! By the way, no ink ribbons. <laughs> Can't save my game. I'm fucked. If you haven't noticed yet, completely fucked. I guess I'll have her drop the bottle for now. Since you can't do anything with it, we haven't found any more gas. What? I want her to pick up the grenade round. She goes through the fucking door. Are you fucking serious? I wanted her to go and pick up the grenade round. She went through the door. This is good. The problem is we can't save the game. I just, I've literally been playing for about an hour and a half. And I can't save my game. There's no ink ribbons anywhere. So I'm completely boned. If I die, I die. And the whole game's over. I gotta replay an hour and a half of gameplay. Isn't that nice? All gonna be out the front door. Oops. So we're almost done at this point, right? I'm going to go out this front door. I'm going to get the final tablet. Then he has to go back upstairs to the, the, the room with the bugs, run past all the bugs, put the three tablets in place. And I don't know what that's going to do, but hopefully that'll get us the fuck out of here. And then we got to see what happens next. Fuck. Hopefully ink ribbon somewhere. All right. Only Billy can push items. Oh, Billy. Use your big masculine muscles, Billy. Push that box right into the frame. There you go. You sexy man beast, you. Now, wait a minute. Push it a little further. Would you push it? A, oh, my God. Push it a little further. There you go. You got this, Billy. All right, Billy. Now from the back. Push it to the... Now from the back, push it to the front. There we go. There we go, Billy. Use it. All right. Now push it over here. Well, we got the, all the tablets now, but unfortunately, we have to kill a bunch of bugs. If you don't remember what I'm talking about, remember the centipede boss room. It's now full of three giant mutant bugs. 
And the reason I need to kill these bugs is because Rebecca has zero health. So in order for us to get into that room where I use the tablets, we need to get past the bugs. And there's no way she's going to do it. She's going to get hit. So I need to have Billy go in there and kill everything. Question is... How am I going to do this? That's the question. Alright, now he's fully fucking loaded. If he can't kill those bugs with 70 bullets, 3 grenades, and 7 shotgun shells, that's a bunch of shit. The question is, can he do it without dying? He does have full health. See? But if he can't do it without dying, basically my game's over and I have to redo the, the last hour to hour and a half of gameplay. Which, quite honestly, I would not appreciate and would pretty much be pretty fucking livid that the game could not give me an ink ribbon. What the hell? What on earth? That was interesting. Training facility complete. I was correct. We finished the mansion. I need to go get those other items out of the mansion because I, I have the feeling we don't need to come back here anymore. So what I'm going to have to do right now for the next five minutes is, is basically get all the items and bring them into this hallway. of the, And then we could go through this door and see what's next. Oh, you use the tablets? Respawn all the bugs. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Respawn all the bugs. Jeez. Wait a minute. What just happened? This door is not the same door anymore. What the fuck? Uh... Huh? Oh my god. What do I do? I can't go back to the mansion. I went there. There was fucking monkeys. I'm fucked. I can't go back? How the fuck do I go back to get all my items? Are you kidding me? I can't go back to get my items, according to this, I guess. Oh my god, what is that? I am super fucked. What the fuck do I do? Either way, there's new enemies. There's two different... The doors are completely different, and I can't get this to revert back to what it was. I'm gonna try to kill the bats, I guess. You saw the bats, right? I can't target these fucking bats. This sucks. This fucking sucks so bad. Oh my god, it almost hit me! How cheap is this, dude? How cheap? I can't even get a shot in. It's gonna hit me. Oh my god! So, unfortunately, guess what? Rebecca needs to run over here. And survive. And if she gets touched by a bat, she dies, and I have to replay an hour and a half of gameplay. Great! Fucking great! Oh my god! Yes! A save room! We got it! Ink ribbons and fucking shotgun ammo. Yes! Ink ribbon, baby. We can save the fucking game! Yes! Alright. Save! At least we get to save. Fuck. Alright. Good shit. Anything else in here? No, huh? Just a save room. Bookshelf lies in total disarray. Someone was looking for something in here. Oh boy. I got two more ink ribbons, too. Okay. Well, still dead end though, so there's something I didn't do yet. Alright. I am vengeance. I am the knight. I am Batman. Okay, we saved the fucking game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Look at this thing. Well, fuck that shit. Just run by it. Let's see if I can get by it quick. Fuck you. Stupid bat. That wasn't bad. But I don't think we can progress. No. What do we do now? I have no idea. Oh, look where I am. Oh, shit. 
door is not the same door anymore. Now this door opens. Remember earlier it was completely locked? Now it opens. Well, I guess I'm going to have to kill the fucking bat boss, aren't I? I'm so happy. Everyone ready? I'm Take the shit on? Alright. I'll hit it with one grenade at a time and run away like a pussy. Ah! Great. Well, I already fucked up. How do I hit it? What the fuck is this? Uh, what am I supposed to do? I can't do anything because there's little bats. Oh, he shoots the wall. Dude, I'm so fucked. I'm gonna have to redo it. Yep. Oh, great. What the fuck? Uh. I just love, I absolutely love these targeting mechanics where you waste your critical fucking ammo on shit that doesn't work. I love it. This is uh, the remastered version where the targeting is extra bad. Oh, okay. I took no damage. What the fuck? Oh my god. Now he's hurt. Fuck this bullshit. Suck my fucking dick. Stupid shit. I just can't get to the door. Yeah, okay. Evil. No. Zero. I'm not taking bullshit damage because the game decided to do something it didn't do before. Fuck you. I got a trophy for it, though. I don't understand. <laughs> Pretty stupid. A trophy for getting hit. Congratulations. You got hit. Have a trophy. You're great. No. This is fucking pissing me off. Resident Evil. He's standing, he's right the fuck in front of me. So close that he can grab me. But when I fire my gun, it misses. Fuck this. What a piece of shit. Let's remaster the game, but not actually improve it at all. Just have the same fucking garbage controls. Wow. 20 bucks for this. 20 bucks. For what? What did they do? Bunch of fucking assholes. It's literally in front of me! And it can't hit it. Resident Evil Zero. I'll just keep redoing it. It's fine. It's fine with me. You want to be a fucking stupid game? You can be a stupid game and I'll just keep re-fucking loading. Suck my dick. I don't know how I'm supposed to kill the boss when the game doesn't aim for the boss. Resident this is an auto-aim mechanic. This has nothing to do with me. I can't manually aim because the game has auto-aim. Yet the auto-aim doesn't work. So I can't hit the boss. How dumb can you be if you're a game developer and you don't make your auto-aim work? Uh, Tried to fire, couldn't. I don't want to I seriously don't want to play this anymore. Resident I don't. Evil I can't zero. hit the fucking boss because the auto-aim doesn't work. I, I'm just so tired of it. I can't hit it ever. It's even He's in front of me striking me, but I can't hit the boss. Like, how stupid can you be if you're a game developer and you think that this is good? I mean, this is terrible. It's not fun. It's fucking annoying. This is gonna take like an hour just to kill this bat. I did it! Yes! Fuck. Got him. Fuck you. <sighs> Die, devil bird. What was the point of that? Hopefully the door unlocks. Fuck. 
Of course, now we're both at danger. Ah, it looks like you could use something to get up there. Hook shot. But guess what? I don't have it. I have to go back to the mansion to get it. And guess what? There's monkeys at the mansion. So I'm fucked. I have no health. Yeah, I'm boned. How am I going to get the hook shot now? I don't know. I'm going to save. I'm just going to have to try a hundred times to get past the monkeys until I successfully do. Well, I'll save and then I'm going to have to keep fucking going back to the mansion until I get, get past the monkeys magically. This is trash. Trash. Throw it in the trash. Take the game disc. Throw it in the trash! You know, there haven't been like any hailing items for the past two hours of me playing the game. You know, that's a good sign of a great game is when they don't actually allow you to have a fair shot at anything. Fine, I'll be as soon as I open this door, I'm gonna be dead. <laughs> oh my god. That's it! How am I supposed to do this? There's no way for me to kill these monkeys without them killing me. It's impossible. This is absolutely impossible. What am I going to do? This might be the end of the playthrough. There's no way to get past these monkeys. It's impossible. They, remember, they even... Remember, even if I took the grenade launcher with me, the monkeys take multiple fucking grenades to kill. So this is going to be it, I think. There's no way for me to kill them. Well, I killed them. Certainly not the way I would have liked to, but I killed them. Why was one monkey die instantly to an acid round and the other one fucking ate the acid round and six more bullets? I don't get it. Can anyone explain this? And don't say hard mode. Hard mode doesn't mean that enemies are supposed to have varying levels of fucking health. That is stupid. Oh. Another red herb, but no fucking green herb. Are you fucking with me? Another red herb. No green herbs. Are you fucking with me? You've got to be kidding me. A red fucking herb. That's it. One red herb. There hasn't even been a green herb for two hours. Why would they keep giving you red herbs? Gas. Oh my god! I'm done. I don't have anything to kill him. It's a cruel joke. This game is a cruel joke! Phew! Oh my god, dude. I almost had a heart attack. A bottle. More ink ribbons. No healing items. None! A device for pumping gas into the room next door. The device is empty. And by the way, here's a canister. Look. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Now I know. Oh my god, everyone. Oh no. Oh no. Guess what? I just, I just figured it out. You're supposed to have Claire go to that room in the mansion. If Claire went to that room in the mansion, she would have been able to use the mixing set to combine these chemicals and solve this puzzle. Guess what? I didn't have Claire go in that room. I had Billy go in that room. I didn't realize you were supposed to put it into her mixing set. So guess what? Claire's going to have to go all the fucking way back to the mansion again. So here's what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to send the Molotovs down that thing to shoot to Billy... So Billy can kill the, 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 the fucking leech guy on the bottom floor and get by and he can progress. Oh my god, look what I found. So now he has the Molotovs that he can use to kill the leech man in the hallway. That's the whole point of this whole thing, right? Now, what I should do is save my game, okay? Save the game. Then I'm going to have to go out to the hallway and kill the leech man. The door should be open. So I should be able to try to progress and figure this shit out. What I need to do 
I need to go get the note from my desk over here. The note on my desk tells me the combination of chemicals and what they make. Wow, I was stuck in place. I got it. I got it and didn't take damage. Holy shit. Nice. Here's a red chemical. I found a green herb. Oh, are we in luck right now, baby. We are in super duper luck. Right? Yes. I was trying to grab this note, which I can't now, look. I can't grab the note. Trying to grab the note on the fucking chair, but the game won't let me go walk towards it to fucking target it. I'm using the wrong key, okay. Gotta give this to Chris. Chris? I said Chris. Give this to Billy, excuse me. Wow, expensive looking art supplies. Just looking at them sends a chill up your spine. You're t you hate artwork. You're not a very cultural person. What the fuck kind of statement was that? Puts a chill up your spine. Artwork. Aha! You know they're gonna wake up. These zombies are waking up. Oh my god. Just give me this. Oh my god, she's dead. Oh, she survived. Holy fuck, she survived. Wow. Now. She's about to die, but she got the key. Let's take a look. Oh, fuck! Hunters! Hunters! Fucking hunters! How am I gonna do this? Oh, my God. All I have... Look at this. I have 30 bullets, and that's it. I can't kill two hunters with 30 bullets, and I have no health and no healing. How the fuck am I gonna pull this off? Oh my fucking god, dude. Well, one thing I'm certainly doing, I'm fucking saving my game, dude. Wow. How the fuck am I gonna do this? Alright, so I'm gonna make this abundantly clear before I start. I'm not going to be able to do this on the first shot. I'm going to die a lot. I'm getting the feeling. And I think in order to prepare for me to fight these two hunters... I'm going to change my outfit. Very nice. She's going to take on these hunters as the Capcom cheerleader. <laughs> Rebecca, Rebecca, she's our girl. If she can't do it, well, she's fucked. Here it is. I'm so boned. This is going to be so fast. Instant death. Watch. Instantly killed. Oh, fucking shit. Holy fucking shit. Jesus, H. <laughs> Okay. Wowzer. What the fuck, dude? That was interesting. <laughs> wow. How am I going to do this? On hard difficulty, they already know you're there. They seriously already know you're there and just fucking come straight at you. The angle is also shit. So there's no way that I'm going to be able to get past it. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a run for it. I'm probably going to die quickly, but let me make a run for it. Let's see what happens. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's the Juggernaut, bitch! Uh. Well, I almost made it to the item. That's the dial that I need. I need that dial to do the combination downstairs. Resident Evil. I might be able Zero. to pull this off if I circle around them. The problem is the camera angle's fucking shit. And the controls, because I'm using the modern controls, changes your direction as you're running. So, this is going to be insanely difficult. You're entering an insane world? <laughs> You're entering an insane world. You played hard difficulty, bitch. You're so fucked. God damn it! If I had gone the other way, he might have missed. Piss my damn it! Oh, it's annoying because the attack is a low swipe. If I can get it so that he doesn't walk up to me there and they do the lunging attacks. Resident. The lunging attacks seem to miss a lot. He's gonna get her. He's gonna hit her. Yep. Damn! I gotta get lucky here. I almost feel if I can pick up the dial and get past this guy that I'm gonna get out of the room. I have that feeling. Resident Evil. I just have to pick the dial up and get out of the room and get past that one guy and I'll be out of the room. But I don't know how I'm gonna do it because. He keeps coming up on me, you know? What a world, what a world. Fucking stupid shit, pick it up! God damn it. Got you, bitch. Oh my god, dude, I had it. You saw what happened, right? I had it, but the camera changed. I was past him. I was past him, but the camera changed, which changed the direction that she moved, which is what's bad about the modern controls. In this game, if this were the, if I were using the old tank controls, she would have kept running forward. But because of the modern controls, it reversed my controls and he ran back toward the fucking hunter. Zero. How annoying! How annoying! Wow, that's the first time that's happened. She got stuck on him and was unable to run around him. Resident. Are you a fucking ass? The fuck? Don't get out of my way, look! <laughs> what a dick! <laughs> Yo, it was like a defensive lineman at the Super Bowl. He's like, fuck that shit, bitch. You ain't getting by me. <laughs> wow, what a Zero. dick. What a dick. That was great. Come on now, that was good. You gotta admit, that was a good one. <laughs> he would not stop. He's like, you're not juking me. <laughs> This is the big leagues now, bitch. You ain't getting by me. Piss my you Damn it. I'm gonna do this. It's just gonna take a while. I'm gonna do it. It's gonna happen. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Piss my you Damn it. Almost. That would have worked, too. Because if he's missed, I would have got by him. I would have been able to grab it quick. Should I try to shoot them this time? I, I know eventually I'll get by them if I keep running. Let me try, just for the hell of it. Let's try to shoot him. Let's see what happened. Get that shit out of my face, bitch. Uh, that does not work out too well. Well. God, like. Hey, young man. You got knocked the fuck out. I got one bullet into him and that was it. A single bullet. I'm going to try one or two bullets to keep leaving and coming back. Wow. He totally changed his attack pattern. Before he would jump from much further back. Now he fucking jumped right away. Alright, it's not going to work. I got to run by them. Resident. Quite the daunting task. Oh my god, I was going for the dial. Ugh. I did it. I made it. 
There you go. I knew I was going to do it. I told you. It was just a matter of time. I did it. I think also before we progress, maybe we'll change the outfits. Golf clap? Golf clap. Now what? What is this? Oh no. What the fuck? Oh! Oh, that was fair! Are you fucking kidding me? They didn't even give me a shot. Resident Evil. Wow. Zero. They did not even give me a chance. They were like, nope, fuck it, you're done. Wow. <laughs> wow. Thanks a fucking load. So, she has no weapons. How is she supposed to kill this thing? Or is she not supposed to? I don't know. I have no idea what just happened. You tell me. You tell me. Alright. Oh my god! Are you fucking kidding me? I only got hit because the camera angle changed twice. Fuck this, man. I only got hit because the camera angle changed twice. Resident. This is really fucking frustrating. And I gotta redo all that again. This sucks. This is shit. I don't even know if I'm supposed to kill this thing or not. Or am I just supposed to run away from it? I don't know what to do. I have no health and I don't know if I can even kill that thing. Well, she's probably going to die and I'm going to have to do it all again. I don't know. I might have to look this up and figure out. Because here's the problem, right? I don't even know. Am I supposed to kill this, this leech guy? Or am I supposed to dodge him and go up and do something in the control room again to reactivate the tram? I don't know. And being that, I'm dying instantly. I kind of need to know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing. I might have to look it up. Alright, here we go. I better be ready to go right back up. Oh my god. Go back up. Saw that? He was swinging. I need to get to a point where he's not swinging. If he's not swinging, I have a chance to get by him. But he was already in mid-swing. Oh my god, he's in mid-swing again! What the fuck, dude? This is insanity. Hard difficulty where the enemies magically track you. Again! I'm done. I gotta go up again. Wow. I'm stuck at this ladder. I'm fucking stuck. <laughs> I'm stuck. I did it! I got past him. Yes. I did it. The Magnum. We found the Magnum. Which is awesome. And I have Magnum rounds, if you remember. Uh, unfortunately, they're back at the mansion. Which I don't know. I don't think we can ever go back and get them. There were nine Magnum rounds that were left back at the mansion. That we never brought with us. Isn't that nice? Well, I guess I'm never getting those. I gotta heal. <clears throat> I have to. I had to. Even though I would have rather waited to get the red herb back, I had to, man. There was no way I was gonna fuck with that. Alright. Oof. Oh, I don't want to do this. No, wait a minute. Go back. Fuck. Fuck. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go the fuck back. Jesus Christ. Don't do this. <laughs> don't do that. Go over here. Oh my god. There's eight ribbons. Yes! I made it. Fucking shit, I made it. I'm gonna drop a couple things here. Oh my god, there's only one ink ribbon. <laughs> I'm gonna drop a couple things because I need to go get the ro the uh, grenade launcher. I gotta go get the grenade launcher, put it in my inventory, bring it over here. Before I save. Alright, hold on. Uh, oh man. Oh, our one save. It's definitely worth it though, and I have to redo that fucking sequence. Alright, there we go. Fucking shit. Whew. Tyrant! It's fucking Tyrant! Surprise, motherfucker! Oh, fucking shit! You gotta be fucking kidding me. 
Hey, what up? I got one, but there's another one. Fuck. Two hunters. Ow! What? Wow, dude, it's such bullshit. It's complete bullshit. It's basically the terrible fucking invincibility animations because he's in an animation from from getting up. I can't hit him right away. It's fucking garbage. Let's remaster the game in a way that you can't actually fucking play it like a modern game. Then it's not remastered. You didn't remaster anything. Fucking trash. I shot it right in the face. Oh, it doesn't count right now. He still had... 0 0.02 seconds of, of invincibility in his animation. <laughs> Capcom. We're Capcom. <laughs> Assholes. I wonder if I can just run by them. And it fucking worked. Umbrella main shaft. She's not wearing that outfit. Don't shoot. Who the fuck? You're alive. Are you okay, Rebecca? These are terrible are fucking Oh, oh my god, it looks so bad. <laughs> Look how bad he them? looks. I need to find I guess it's her commanding officer. Don't worry. I guess he died. What's this? Jill? Oh Is shit. Boys, Enrico's? Yeah? You're alive! Wait there! Are it's not Enrico, it's Enrico. What? Oh, yes! Enrico! Uh, here we go. So, Barry and Jill together. Are you alright, Enrico? Can you talk any slower? I don't think that we're have a long enough pause between what we're saying. Doomed. Someone is a traitor. Everything was uh, plotted from the start by Umbrella. Huh? Oh, someone killed him. <gasps> Enrico! And uh, welcome to my playthrough of Resident Evil Director's Cut. And this is a game that I have a lot of history with. This is a game that I actually did play on the original PlayStation 1 back in the 1990s. No need to search this place, huh? Umbrella control area. You know what? Hold on a second. This is the Umbrella area. Which one was it? Was it... Resident Evil 2 or 3, where you end up in this, because doesn't this look familiar? I think they reused some of the sections from one of the games, because that door that says you don't need to search it, security room, that was a save room in another Resident Evil. I think this was the entrance to the final area in Resident Evil 2. It seems familiar. I think so. Oh, no! What is that? That is bad fucking news! It's tiring! He's free. This, now wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. In the continuity of things, this makes no sense at all. The tyrant was in the mansion. And he wasn't set free until the end of Resident Evil 1. We're not even during Resident Evil 1 yet. This makes no fucking sense. I'm going to equip the Magnum right away. Oh, it's time, baby! Oh, great! The Juggernaut, bitch! This is not good. So, I don't understand this. How could this be tiring? I'm confused. Silly bitch, your weapon's gonna harm me. Oh, good. Oh, 
Play about 15 minutes of gameplay. Resident Evil. Just what I wanted to do. Zero. Great. Oh, guess what? I have to get past those hunters again. Yup. Because I didn't get to save. I have to run past those hunters again. I have to go get the key and do all this again. Completely over. Oh. Oh, good. Oh, good. Wow. Completely fucked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great, it is zero damage. This is pissing me the fuck off, dude. Come on. Well, I gotta do all this over again. So much fun. Oh, what fun it is to do the same shit over and over. Perp, derp, 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 derp. Perp, derp, 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 derp. The game only give me one ink ribbon. Suck my fucking chode. Why am I singing Christmas songs? <laughs> A little late for Christmas. End of January. Herp, derp, 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 derp. Herp, 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 derp. What? I'm standing right in front of the elevator. You don't need this now. What? I was standing right here a second ago, you stupid game. <laughs> All right. Herping derp. do anything. The game wouldn't even let me move. This sucks. Yeah, look at this. I can't move. Look. I couldn't get out. Fuck this, dude. This sucks. This sucks. 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 This sucks. This is fucking shitty dicks. Bunch of fucking balls. Come on. It's just luck. It's just like every time that I ran past the fucking hunter, I just gotta keep doing it until the tyrant doesn't hit me. Due to luck. So, luck, 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 luck. Luck, luck, luck. Fucking luck. Yes, this sucks fucking luck. See, I'm using Resident Evil 1 logic. In Resident Evil 1, there were two different ways to kill the tyrant. You could either just shoot the living fuck out of it, but if you didn't have a lot of ammo, but you had magnum ammo left, you could just shoot it in the heart a couple times, and it would die. And that's what I'm thinking here, is I gotta try to aim it. Every time I shoot it and he hits stunned like that, he's in a stun animation, 
that that's what I'm supposed to do, just keep doing that. But I could be wrong. I don't know, because again, it's a different game. I've never played this game before. I'm standing right in front of the keyhole. Oh, I'm in an attack animation. I'm invincible. Shotgun. He detect a different direction. Ah! I couldn't see. The camera changed and fucked me. I had him. All you need to do is run back and forth there. Well, once again, the camera change fucks me. I was getting out of the way. Camera change makes me run into him. <laughs> oh my god. This sucks. Told you it's so random. It's just fucking completely random. I'm playing it according to a pattern. And nope, because of random bullshit. So much fun. It's so much fun to redo the same shit over and over again. <sighs> Well, I almost got past him. Look, now I can't get look, now I can't get away! Oh my just kill me. Just kill me, asshole. <sighs> fucking bullshit. So this time he attacks four fucking times and I can't get by him. Yes. What a great game. Resident Evil. I couldn't run to the direction I fucking wanted. These controls are terrible. I'd rather have tank controls. Look! I can't move. I'd rather have tank controls at this point. Controls. What the fuck is this? God. I'm just gonna leave it on default. I don't want to mess with it. Couldn't go the right way. I tried. Nope, couldn't move. Again, the camera fucks me. Fuck this, dude. Fuck it! Here we go, it's Hello Hunter number one. Hello Hunter number two. I ran past you. Yeah. <laughs> All I gotta do is croon. If I do crooning singing to my enemies, they'll just leave me alone. Oh, baby. 
Oh, please don't hit me. Tyrant down. Phew. Alright, that was flawless. That was pretty flawless. Factory complete. Yes! There's an ink ribbon. Yeah! <laughs> Excellent. Phew. Well, we got past the hurdle. We got past the hurdle. Looking for a square peg. Everyone, like I said, imagine if you knew you were going to be in like a Resident Evil like situation. I'd take fucking keys. I'd take fucking lock picks. I'd have pegs up the ass. Hexagonal, round, fucking square peg. Every kind of peg possible. Just pegs, a, a whole key ring of pegs. Damn straight. No. Nothing. I know what I got to do drain it and then push the boxes around to make a bridge. Okay. So this is Resident Evil before. So I need to push these boxes around. Wait a minute. I just realized something. She can't. She can't push boxes around, can she? Oh, yes, yeah, she can. Never mind. Oh. Okay. So the brown boxes float. The, b the black box never floats. That sounds like a problem. What the fuck is that noise, dude? There's a ladder here. Oh my! What are those? Oh! No! Ah! What the fuck, dude? Oh, fucking shit. That's a bad one right there. Oh, man. Ah, 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 ah. That was a bad pull. Holy shit. I almost got eaten. I killed them all here. I did it. I cleared the way. Nice. I think there's ammo on the other side. I think I saw ammo on the ground there. Oh, no. That is bad. That is very bad. How the fuck did that just work? Huh? I took a little bit of damage, but I don't even know how I just killed him with that shotgun blast. That was bizarre. Well, there's a save room here, supposedly. Let's clear the room first. Don't know how, but we're surviving. Alright, he's got to save. Oh, nice dead body. Look at the guy. <laughs> Look at the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Watch this. I'm going to troll the dead body. Watch this. <laughs> I troll you. <laughs> wow. Nice face. So let's save ourselves some time. What I mean by that is that we know that... Oh, no! Oh, my God. The tyrant. Oh, boy. Seven nine rounds. Eight nine rounds. Oh boy. Ugh. Oh. Proto Tyrant down again. Oh, I got him. I used all my fucking ammo. God damn, dude. Oh! 
Oh my god! What the fuck is that? Get up this ladder! Fuck! Holy shit, what was that? Jesus H. Christ, a mutant fucking frog, dude! I almost, I almost shat. I'm not even fucking lying, I almost fucking just squirted in my pants, dude. What the fuck? A frog? A frog out of nowhere. I almost fucking gave up the fucking... Gave up the pants right there, man. That was bad. That, I can't take those kind of scares. Alright, well, hello everyone. If you are watching this playthrough, whether you're watching live on stream or on YouTube, I have no idea. If you're watching on demand on YouTube is what I mean. I believe we're in the end game of Resident Evil Zero. At least people last night after I finished playing, told me you're basically right at the end, I guess what you're seeing here. But from what I'm to understand, a couple things. Number one, apparently I'm pretty boned because I don't have enough ammo to fight the final boss. Noticed, I've been using a lot of ammo recently on zombies and other stuff. People are like, uh, you, you need more. If you remember, the grenade launcher I left way back when, before I even fought the first version of Tyrant. From what I'm being told, especially because I'm playing this on hard difficulty, I'm going to have to backtrack to get that ammo. Number two, I need to backtrack anyway to get the key card. Here's what I think I'm going to do to start. She's not, is she following him or not? She is. All right, I'll check it out. Roger. I think what I want to do first, I want to go to this next room, which I've only been in briefly. I want to see if I need the key card to get into that next area. I know there's monsters in here. No! Oh my god. There's magnum ammo and handgun ammo right fucking there. Oh, wait a minute. What is this? It links back, dude. Are you fucking shitting me? What? Now, wait a minute. I wasn't even in danger. I was in caution, and the game killed me. Resident Evil. Are you Zero. fucking kidding me? That is insane bullshit. So now, let's recap. I shotgun blasted the zombie in the face. He didn't die. And he ate me, even though I was in caution, not in fucking danger. That's interesting. That's quite interesting to me. That's what we call complete fucking bullshit. Okay. You've got to be kidding me. Again. That's exactly the same thing that happened last time. This is bullshit. So what they've done, they put super-powered zombies in this hallway. Resident Evil. I'm going to have to waste Zero. I'm going to have to waste tons of ammo to kill these zombies in order to pick up the other ammo cuz I think what I need to do is unlock it'll unlock to the tr So that means no more I'm not even going to try for a headshot. I'm not going to try for a headshot at all. I'm just going to shoot straight ahead at them with the shotgun until they die. I'm going to end up wasting all my fucking shotgun rounds. It sucks, but I can't do anything about it. They're fucking overpowered, dude. Yeah. Yeah, Thank you. 
Oh, shotgun blast to my face. I eat that shit for breakfast. Thanks a lot. Yeah, uh huh. I understand it's the end of the game. There's absolutely no excuse for them to make a zombie that powerful. Not only does it fucking absorb a headshot shotgun shell, but then it insta-kills you when you're not even in danger. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? What kind of bullshit was that? At least I'm fine, but still, that's bullshit, dude. Alright, so we're on a mission. Acid rounds and key card. Oh my god, dude, are you fucking for real? This is utter bullshit. Now I'm hurt. Yeah. Oh no, I'm still fine. How the fuck? How am I still fine? They must be weak zombies. No frog. I don't understand why the frog came that one time and never showed up again. That's bizarre. A one-time frog. I'll go alone. Okay. No frog. Come on. Big bucks, no whammies. Yes. I got big bucks, no whammies. Nice. No frog. What happened that one time there was a fucking frog and never came back? This is so bizarre. Only that one time? Yeah, look, no frog. I don't know what happened. I never shot it. Follow me. Okay. I don't get it. I don't get it, but I'm certainly not gonna look a gift horse in the mouth. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. So this should be the final time I need to get across this dam. I don't know if there's gonna be a frog. There was no frog the last 20 times. I'll go alone. Okay. What's this? Uh oh. Uh oh. What? Rebecca wasn't with me. This is bullshit. Oh fucking shit! Yeah. He looks really weird. I'll have my revenge on Umbrella. And the world will burn in an inferno of hate. <laughs> You'll pay for what you've done. We'll see which one of us is gonna die. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Yuck. What the fuck? This ain't good. Oh my god. What the fuck, dude? I don't know what to do here. I guess this is a boss. Right? This sucks. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Guys, I guess I just gotta keep shooting and kill it. I didn't want Rebecca with me. This sucks. 
I really didn't want Rebecca with me for this. That did not go very well, mostly because I'm trying to control two people during a boss fight, which is nearly fucking impossible. Instant replay, please. What the hell's this? Warner the generally was independently, but you can use right thumbstick to control them yourself. Welcome back, this is the continuation of my Resident Evil Zero remastered playthrough. This is actually my second gameplay session, so second day that I'm actually playing the game. And I just learned something, look at this, I literally just learned this. You can control both characters at the same time. You can control both characters at the same time. You can control both characters at the same time. What is your major malfunction, numbnuts? That was really tough, because I didn't want Rebecca with me to begin with. I didn't want her with me. Resident Evil. Because oh. I don't even know, I unloaded all that ammo. Is that what I was supposed to be doing? Or was there like a puzzle or something to kill the boss? I have no idea. I don't even know, is that, is that the final boss? If that's the final boss, why is there a save room past him? That doesn't even make sense. I'm so confused. Ugh. Great views. Well, I guess he's dead. <sighs> Problem is I don't know what to do. It's obvious there's a pattern. You need to know you do probably gotta split them up, have one go to the other side of the room so he doesn't fucking go after them, while one of them just lays into him with all the fucking ammo and try not to get hit. The problem is it's incredibly difficult to control two characters at once. One of them always seems to stumble or he goes after the other one. Oh, it's frustrating, man. And I don't, also don't know how close I was to stopping him, because I almost had no ammo. I had, what, like two or three grenade rounds left, and then a shotgun, and that was it. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Just gotta keep trying, I guess, right? I just gotta keep plugging away. Fuck. Alright. So, as, 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 as apprehensive as I am about it, I'm gonna leave Rebecca equipped with the shotgun and see if the computer's AI will actually fucking shoot this thing or not. I guess we'll find out. I'm not very, very, uh, I'm not really trusting it too much, but I, I figure a new, a different approach might be worth it here, rather than her just standing there and being a fucking damage sponge. Mutant frog, where are you? <laughs> Dooby dooby doo, frog, where are you? You disappeared and never came back now. You only showed up once. What a dunce. You made this part really easy. I got him. Nice. Woo! Got his ass. It worked. Having her shoot worked well. That was great. And I got tons of ammo left, too. Look at this. Drop some items. He's got six grenade rounds left and two flame rounds. Wow, that wasn't bad at all, man. Let's have her use the first aid spray. We have full health. Holy shit. Wow, that worked super well. So now, it's, we're not, it's not over. We still gotta get to a, a new save room, and apparently there's more after it. Jesus. Alright, let's see what happens here. Unfortunately, the fact that they just gave me all this shit makes me feel something really nasty is coming. <laughs> something really fucking nasty is coming. Alright, let's swap here. I might as well just have him. All he has is the grenade launcher with freaking 12, 14 rounds. What does she have? She's got the handgun and she's got the shotgun. Okay, we should start with this and see what happens. Uh, there's no other fucking save point in the game, supposedly. So I might as well leave this. Right? Alright, let's see what we got. Oh, 
All right, the final push. Oh boy! All employees! All employees! All employees! All employees! All employees! All employees! All fucking employees! All employees! All employees! All employees evacuate! All employees must stuff their mouth with ballpark beef franks, delicious Angus beef, flavors across the rainbow, toes, elbows, and assholes, shove them in your mouth. Ballpark beef franks, beef byproducts possible. Ah! I'm still fine. What the shit? She's a caution. All employees, get the fuck away from that fucking thing. Can't handle sunlight. Sunlight. We need to open the windows. All employees. You work on the windows. Got it. I'll use my charm to distract your majesty. Uh. What am I supposed to do? I'll use my charm to distract your majesty. I got no ammo. Well, she's dead. What the fuck? So not only do I have to start, start do a first form, then I have to fucking protect her as she does this, but I have no ammo to stop it. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Resident Evil. You're in a fucking Zero. dead end. Back to, you're back against the wall against the boss with no ammo to fight it. Uh... What the fuck? Well, that sucked ass. That seriously sucked. The first form fight wasn't too bad. The second form fight is complete horseshit. I don't know what they expect me to do. Great. Team kill. Wow, double kill. <laughs> double kill. I know not to go that way this time. Holy shit. Resident Evil Zero. Double fucking kill. Wow. <laughs> jo 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 double kill. Double kill. <laughs> that was pretty good. That's like the highlight of the playthrough for me. A fucking double kill. I can't give her the fucking healing. Why not? She's right fucking next to me, and I can't give her the healing, nor can I exchange items. This sucks. The system has sucked for the entire game. I can't give it to her. Now, oh my god. Oh. I can't get it to die now. What the hell? There. Fuck. Well, she died. I couldn't even see what was going on. Yeah, this last sequence sucks. This final sequence sucks monkey shit because you can't see what's going on half the time. She's running into other areas of the map. You don't even know where she is. You're trying to get his attention and sometimes it doesn't even work. If I had more ammo, this would be easier, but I don't have any real ammo that could do damage to him because I got to pump it into him to get to this point. Uh, it's pretty annoying, but I'm going to I'm definitely going to beat it. Here we go again. Our closer. That time she did 2 of 4. Two of four. Uh, super annoying. The problem is the bullets do nothing. The bullets do absolutely nothing.
right, here we go again. Give it to me. She still won't give it to me. Oh. You're still hitting her somehow. What the fuck? Now I gotta go get the weapon from her. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Dude, it's taking more damage than ever before now. Dude! This is insanity. I'm shooting the fucking boss. It doesn't pay attention. Sucks, man. I can't stop him from attacking her. I have no ammo. That's it. Fuck. Dude, I have, I have 20 bullets left. What am I going to do? Wow. Immediately hits me. Almost I have 8 bullets left. Three or four, but I have no bullets left to do anything. Hurry your ass up, you bitch. No ammo. Hurry up. She did it. She did it. She did it. Is that it? I think we did it. I think we did it. Oh my god, did we do it? We did it! Oh my god, we did it! Yes! Yes! Fuck you! Woo! Got you, motherfucker! Oh shit, she found a magnum! Billy! <gasps> she found an extra magnum. Queen. We did it. Feast.
feast on this. Oh yeah, baby. Here it comes. Damn, heart shot. Even though it's a leech, it has no heart. Ew. And now with no ammo, time for the super duper secret boss, Wesker. Here he comes. Billy! <laughs> Rebecca, hurry! I'm just a zombie now, baby. Ten hut, motherfucker. Rebecca. And Billy was never seen again, ever. For some reason. It's kind of true, right? He was never seen again, ever. <laughs> Rebecca went to the Spencer Mansion, and all kinds of fucked up stuff happened there, too. Resident Evil Zero, that's it! I've completed! Not only the only Resident Evil I've never played before, but I'm gonna say the most difficult one by far. Of course, I did play it on hard difficulty, but uh, that was really tough. That was some of the most challenging stuff I've done in games in a while. It was fun, though. It certainly was a fun ride. And, uh, you know, I'm glad that I did it. I'm certainly glad that I played it. Jeez, what's next for Resident Evil? We don't even know if a new one's coming out, right? We do know that they're remaking Resident Evil 2, which, I mean, I would definitely consider playing the remake if people wanted to see me do it. But I had a lot of fun. I can now put it under my belt to say that I beat this game on a hard difficulty, which is pretty damn grueling, but I did it. Whether it was dodging multiple hunters in a room with no ammo and no health to get an item, or, uh, you know, zombie dodging, or backtracking to get items in order to fucking kill bosses. Pretty good. Pretty entertaining. Pretty fun and challenging, but good, but fun, you know? Pretty nice. Now, I believe, actually, this beating the game will unlock a new mode. I wonder if I can skip this. I can. I believe this will unlock a new mode. Rank of D! Treatment plan complete. Treatment plan complete. Why did I get two trophies? From zero to hero, silver trophy. Hey, Queenie, feast on this. Jesus, look at all these trophies. I got four trophies for beating the game. Probably because I did on hard difficulty, I'm thinking. Wow. Rank of D. You can now play Leech Hunter. You can now play Wesker mode. Ah, whoa, whoa. Look at Rebecca here. What the hell? That's bizarre looking. Huh. All right, you know what I think I'm going to do? I do think that I'm going to uh, try out this these modes just to see what the hell they are. You seem to know me. Been fantasizing about me, have you? Yes, I always fantasize about You're Wesker. prisoner that was being transferred <laughs> for execution. You were with those soldiers outside. All right, skip this. I want to be Wesker, man. I got to get to being Wesker. Oh, fuck! Dogs! <laughs> He's got a trophy. Fire! She won't fire her gun. Dude, I can't kill the dog. Finally, I'm about to die. The dog almost killed me. What the fuck? Character switching, we know all about that. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Fuck Stop you, fucking lying. Alright, we're Wesker now. So Wesker apparent oh my god. His eyes glow red. <sighs> Look at this. What the fuck? Oh shit! It's not working. Oh! Well, that's Wesker mode, ladies and gentlemen! Wow! 
That was really useful. Abilities that didn't work. They didn't go through her body, so it wasn't able to hit the zombie, and she died, and I didn't save. So that's Wesker mode. Basically, it's a crappy throwaway mode. And there's no reason to play it, unless you want to replay the game again a second time as Wesker, using an ability that didn't target properly. Just like the targeting of the regular game, so I'm not too surprised. <laughs> wow, I'm going to be honest, that was pretty pathetic and lame. And there's absolutely no reason to buy this game to play with Wesker. This is a complete waste of time, and I think that unless you really absolutely love the game and want to replay the entire campaign, there's zero reason to do this. That is just silly. So, anyway. Wow, Wesker mode. Apparently there's one final mode. Isn't there Leech Hunter mode? Resident Evil. Let's see if we can do Leech zero. Hunter mode. Leech Hunter. How to play. Let's see. Your mission. Find all the blue and green leech charms in the umbrella facility and exit the mansion's front door. Leech charm features. A brilliant Brecca can only carry a certain color of leech charm and it cannot be exchanged between characters. Oh, good god. They can't be dropped. Once you acquire a leech charm, it cannot be dropped. Up to 10 leech charms can be stored in your inventory as one item. You have to get 50 of them. If you exit to the mage's front door or if either character dies, the game ends. Wow. <laughs> okay. Ha 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 ha. Whoa! Shit! Christ, how many hunters are down here? Wow. Uh. No. Another throwaway mode. <laughs> So the two things you unlock once you beat the game are complete and utter throwaway mode. Oh, I got a trophy! Look! I got a trophy. Huh. Wow. You got the E-rank item, submachine gun ammo. Check your status screen after you start the game. So apparently you can get, you unlock, as you play that mode, you unlock more stuff for it, huh? So, basically, Wesker mode, you replay the entire game from the start as Wesker with uh, some abilities that kind of suck. And Leech mo Hunter mode, you're just running around killing insane waves of enemies. There are fucking five hunters in the basement there. Uh, I can understand if, you're, if you really love the game, why you would like to do that. I already beat it on hard. I have no desire to replay the game again this soon as well. I'm, it's actually a little disappointing because the other Resident Evil games, you get Mercenaries mode, where you get to play as different characters and loadouts. And this Leech Hunter mode is, like, lame compared to that. I think that the Mercenaries mode from other Resident Evils is much better than this. So, hey, at least I got a trophy for it, right? And now I've uh, investigated all of the content of the game. So that is the full coverage of Resident Evil Zero Remastered. I hope that you enjoyed the playthrough. Uh, certainly playing on hard was a massive challenge, but I able, was able to do it, and, uh, you know, all the better, I guess, right? Another, another notch on my belt, another game that I've beaten, uh, with some pretty grippling difficulty and challenges, so. Alright, that is it, everyone. I'd like to thank you very much for watching.